It doesn't sound like Eric Johnson. You have an Eric Johnson <laughs> thin line Stratomacaster there, don't you? You do too. I do. And I like it. I like yours. Cool. <laughs> you want to trade? <laughs> no. Um, so this, it is pretty cool. It took me a little bit to get used to the neck, but yeah, it's yeah, fun to it's, play. It's, it's got that V shape to it, which I know you kind of like the V necks. I do. Yeah, I do too. Yeah, this is. Um, I don't own any V necks. It's, it's a pretty soft guitars. V. That's what it's called, right? Yeah. Soft V. Yeah. But it's there. I mean, it's it's not. Yeah, you can tell. Yeah. It gives you something to kind of anchor on. This neck, too, this maple neck, uh, this is like all one piece. It's not a neck with a fretboard on top of it. This is just one piece sir. of lumber. I don't know why I'm doing this. <laughs> I don't either. But that's Seems it's a cool. little out of place. But. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. But I so. do like it. It's got a good feel to it. It is, uh, what's a 12-inch radius? Yeah. So... Not you can too. feel like when you're playing this thing, you can feel the semi hollowness. Like you there's can. a lot of guitars that you can't. Like it, there's it's not got, enough difference. It's got that resonance to it that 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 it does. only a semi hollow can. It does, can and you can you can when it put, makes you play. Like I wanted to play slower, more melodic, more feel type things, more space mm -hmm. to kind of let it breathe. Mm -hmm. Played into that for me. Yeah. Um, Alder. Alder body. Yeah, which I like a good From Alder. Alderon. Alderon. <laughs> Places <That's laughs> blown to smithereens, isn't it? <laughs> so the, there's the, still a few trees left. <laughs> they're floating in space. So the um, cool things about this guitar, or let's not even call them cool. Let's just call them different things that, Think, that stand things, out. Things about this guitar. Eric Johnson things. <laughs> So it's got the cool back plate. Yeah, it's got the EJ. Yeah. Get the, it's really the thing. Cool. Let's you know what you got. So yeah. uh, also, as you notice, it does not have a back plate no. for the, no. not the even, trim system. Not even drilled out to screw one no. in there, is it? No, it's not like you just had it and took it off. No. So that's a that's an Eric Johnson thing. And these right? bridges are pretty anchored down. Yeah. We don't want to bend them up. Not that you could alter that if you wanted to yeah you could you could loosen you could let things loose a Make little bit more springy yeah so it is cool i like it and then obviously semi hollow single piece um pick guard which is one ply. bare bones one ply yeah, yeah i shouldn't say single piece yeah but one ply good yeah. good job good catch with the, the eric johnson these these are not just these are not just pickups out of a average bin of pickups at Fender. These are Eric Johnson special pickups. You do say. I do say. You do say, say. say. So never gonna get me copper, no. say. <laughs> <laughs> so we didn't put the, the whammy bars in these because we want these to be pristine and like new whenever you order them. And we don't want to lose it. Yeah, and there's a spring in there you're gonna lose. Yeah. We we don't want to do that yeah. for you. You're gonna lose it, but we don't want to do it before we're not gonna lose it. So cool thing about these knobs is this knob actually does something for this pickup am i correct that's right if you've seen any of our other videos i harp about that a lot that that did not do that for or still doesn't do it for a lot of strats like standard strats you know so this having that to me makes that pickup a little more usable because That sounds like a riff I've heard before. It probably I'm is, totally and I hope we don't get thrown in tri yeah, prison so. over that. I don't think so. But anyway, so it this knob does something for this pickup, which it used to only do for that one. So um, very cool, and it has the what 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 are these tuners, Rob? I'll let you explain. The tuners. The tuners. These are like the old Cluson style. Yes. Tuners. You said something about them before we started that intrigued me. Did you forget that? And they have the, the open slot here, which yes. I kind of like those. That's what it was. I like that. Easy to string those up. A lot of people never seen that before. Like, oh my gosh, that's that might be really difficult to string it's that. Not, up. It's not. It's pretty. It makes it pretty easy. If yeah. you know the length to cut it, it makes it very you easy. You just usually go like one or two past. Yeah. Yeah. 
couple passes. We've got that in a video on moreguitars.com. Yeah. Um, so there's no string trees on this. And uh, I think Eric's deal with that is that he doesn't like it because it keeps him, feels like it hinders him bending. Is well, what on I've these, heard the, in the posts past. on these tuning machines are, are scaled. So this one's longer than this sure. one too. So you get yeah. kind of an even straight shot yeah. out of the nut to the tuner instead of pinching it down there with a string tree yes. and causing this to occur. Yep. And uh, you know, that's what I'm, I, I guess that's what I'm getting at is that <clears throat> well, he, spit wanted it out, to, man. he wanted to get rid of these string <laughs> trees. So they did this to facilitate that. Yeah. And my last dinner with Eric the other day, I'm just kidding. I've never <laughs> had dinner with Eric, but, um, but anyway, so that's what I've heard is that they, he did not like the string trees. So they changed these to facilitate that desire. So before this gets too off Who's the rails. Who's going to question Eric Johnson? If you do, you better be pretty damn good yeah. and have a good ear. Because he can, like, tell when his batteries are going dead in his pedals. Yep. Well, yeah. Like. I heard he can tell the difference, like. In brands. In brand of battery and the, like, yeah. That's yeah. crazy. He probably can. I don't. <clears throat> so that's, these are cool. I'm, I'm digging them. digging them. digging them. digging them. digging them. digging them. We should probably play a little bit. <laughs> up so you can play something clean. Oh, I like it dirty. I know you do. Let's hear what that sounds like. starting last week. Position four. There. It's got a little sparkle. A little spank. A little whip. There it is. It's got it. <laughs> All right, so there. You can't say we didn't play them. So, Defender, uh, Eric Johnson, Thin Line, Stratocaster. I like it. Available now at, at moreguitars.com mm. in two flavors. Two flavors. Vanilla and what would you call it? Chocolate, I guess. I don't know. Yeah. But sunburst and bun non-sunburst. <laughs> <laughs> Good job. Yes. We'll label them like that. Yes, on the, sunburst on the, and non-sunburst. Just like in the 50s, they had two colors, black and black. <laughs> black. Black and not black. Yeah. So anyway, before this gets too silly, uh, we are moreguitars.com, and we are here to help you. We are excited to help you. We are not salespeople. We are guitarists that want to help you. Absolutely. Um, you can call us. You can chat with us. You can email us. Any way you want to get in touch with us, please check us out. We're here to help some of the nicest guys in the bidness. Bidness. I said that on the last video, and I kind well, of well, you mean it. You up. know, it's you're passionate about it, and you should say it every time. Yes, it's true. If you say it more than once, it's true, it's right? True. <laughs> so anyway, moreguitars.com. Thanks for stopping by. Thanks. We'll see you next time.